Right now, the final preparations are underway for the latest campaign 2014 debate. Tonight, Eyewitness News and the Providence Journal are teaming up to bring together Republican Alan Fung, Democrat Gina Raimondo, and moderate Robert Healy, just two weeks before voters elect one of them Rhode Island's next governor. And what's said tonight could tip the scales in this tight race. Eyewitness News reporter Walt Buto has a live preview now from the Providence Mobile Newsroom. Little doubt that the Providence mayoral race has dominated the headlines in the Rhode Island political season, at least lately. But tonight, as you see on the marquee here at PPAC, the gubernatorial debate is back on stage. Voters want to hear specifics during tonight's debate. Don't just give According me to Eyewitness News political analyst Joe Fleming. They're not always going to go online and read a paper online or two or three pages with the stuff. They want to hear the candidates say, here's what I'm going to do to create jobs around. Here's what I'm going to do to control the budget. Here's what I'm going to do for taxes. Not just generalities. Give some specifics. Fleming tells us the two front runners have a real shot at gaining the undecided voter, which could decide this race. Two thirds of those voters are independent, according to our most recent poll. So that means they're really open minded, which means both Gina and Alan has a shot for these voters. But when we looked at them, we found that like 70% of them have a very favorable opinion of Alan Fung. Only 49% have a favorable opinion of Gina. Moderate Bob Healy polled at 8%. This is the first time this year we've seen the former Cool Moose on a big stage. Fleming says he fills a void for a segment of Rhode Islanders. I cannot vote for Gina because of the pensions, public sector employees, public sector retirees, and they're saying, I'm a Democrat, I don't want to vote for a Republican, so Bob Healy gives me the alternative. Tonight at 6, Fleming on whether fireworks or the issues will dominate tonight's debates. In Providence with the Mobile Newsroom, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News. And you can watch tonight's debate live as it happens beginning at 7 right here on WPRI 12 and streaming live on WPRI.com.